But when you head out fishing to chase one particular species and another one comes along that's twice as big, things can get chaotic pretty fast. Now this ain't clickbait, it absolutely goes off. And I'm fishing just a little landlocked lake with a drainage system. Don't forget to give us a big thumbs up, drop a comment if you like, and subscribe. Enjoy. Here we go. Here we go. Put this livey on. Just going up to the right there. Just going up to the right. Okay. Here we go. He needs to head back. Send it out some. Send it out some. Vibration, yeah. Okay, so he's been smart and he's coming back that way. I need him to go out that way. Yeah, GT, there's a big GT up there, right? Yeah, Giant Trevally, how big do you reckon he was? How many kilo? I reckon he was that big. Yeah, okay, yeah, six, eight kilo. Maybe even a bit more. But at least I can tell you're not exaggerating. Mm. <laughs> I know the fishermen that exaggerate. <laughs> They're the blokes with one arm. Yeah, I'm just getting this guy to swim out. I'll just feed him out, slowly. Oh, that's alright, like... I did throw a bait out the other week and he smashed it, but I had it on real light gear, I was just mucking around. You know, I didn't have my heavy gear here. I mean, you can get away with it on the lighter stuff, but... If he runs and hits that corner... Oh, he won't do it on this. Not on this gear. Nah, I was looking at it, it looks pretty solid. <laughs> oh, mate, this is... That's why I don't muck around, you know, I want to get the fish in quick here, just to sort of preserve him a little bit as well, you know, rather than wearing him right yeah. down to the bone. <sighs> Amazing the bloody fish and let them get around this place. I was amazed when I come down the coast how many fish were, you know, even around. Yeah, they um they get trapped here and and that's all they do. They just get trapped and yeah. don't go back out and there's a good food source for them and Wow, just get him out there. Just turn his tail around. Plenty of options for me the way. Yeah. Sold his bait. He wasn't using his work too much. Got a 585 seeker. Oh, yeah. 150 Ocean Pro one. Yeah, that'd be good. Yeah, so what do you normally catch offshore? Um, mainly um, snapper and things with the big eyes. Oh, yeah, you go right out deep off yeah, the shelf. Yeah, we go. No, not to the shelf. No, those. Uh, Mate, I'm a bugger for remembering stuff, so bear with me. No, you're um, right. That'd be those, like, cod kind of fish. No, no, it's a well-known fish. Uh, the big eyes. <coughs> um, is it like a kind of tuna or something? Or? No, no, not that, no. Oh, I'll tell you what, we... Sometimes when we're dropping down, we get some of those uh, things that the chows love. Uh, and use that for bait. That was good bait. They hit you on the way when you drop dropping down. Like a Mac tuna or No, it's not Oh he just needs to see this bait. God he's a big one. I'm just gonna he hasn't spotted us yet. No. I can hear you walk. He's got it, he's got it. He's got it. 
You got it. Fun, eh? oh, <laughs> oh, my legs are shaking. That's 300 pound. Doesn't the adrenaline start running? Woo. We'd be out there fishing away on them. We'd be pulling them bloody. <laughs> Your hands are shaking too. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I got excited when that happens. So did I. Oh, right, that's it. I'm going home. I'm done. That's why I go fishing if anyone wants to know. <laughs> you got it.